Let's go down here to shoot number two. Shoot number two is where we're going. This is going to be the next set of cowboys coming your way. It's going to be Detweiler and the heck right here. Ian McDonald is the cowboy that rides for them. Foxtrot is the name of the horse. Deadwater and Heck looking to punch their ticket to the World Championships. We'll see what happens right here as they try to top that score of 82 in the bronc riding from last night. 82, 81, 379s and 377s. That's what you're up against to get in the top seven or eight right there. All right, the good horse coming your way for Deadwater and Heck, Foxtrot, Ian McDonald making a ride. Had a little trouble right here getting the horse to stand up straight. He's got to be able to get both them feet down. They ride an everyday working saddle. That means the horn is still intact. If they land wrong on that horn, he'll be talking in a whole different octave at church tomorrow. I promise you what. That cowboy right there make for a long night if that doesn't go the way you're supposed to. All right, looks like we're about ready to go. For eight seconds, we want to make a little noise. All you can do to help him, that's what you want to do. You bet, nice work right here. He hit again by the cowboy Ian McDonald from Foxtrot as they get one covered. So, Deadwilder and Heck going in the first section. Remember this section, then another at the conclusion of the wild cow milking coming your way just a little bit. And gonna be a 73, 73 for Deadwilder and Heck. So, let's go down to the next team coming your way. Looks like we're moving over to the far bucking shoots. And it's gonna be shoot number well, it looks like we're going to five right down here. We'll find out who it is for you. Horses are out by our considerably talented pickup man, Rooster Schwartz and Paul Salberg. Good job, gentlemen. All right, let's go to high card right here. This is going to be high card ranch. Bronk Horn. And Bronk Horn is the cowboy on Trail of Tears, the horse you're going to see right here. So we'll see if we can get a higher mark than that 82, but you're gonna have to have your strong bronc. But if you're gonna get them, you're gonna get them from three lazy ass broncs right here. They have supplied these good horses. Right here's what we're trying to get right. The cowboy's got it set. And as he steps away, calls for him. Here we go, look at this big bay horse. Yes, sir. Go on with him right there. Get you some, boys and girls. make it right there, pulls the eject button and hits the ground. You say him salute that horse just a little bit, I'll tell you what, that's a good ride by that cowboy. Good job picking up that flank. Thank you, young man. Good job for Broncorn. Broncorn, well, his name lived up to it. He had him a Bronc and he rode him to the horn. Good job, Bronc. We'll see what they think about that ride. Hey, thanks to our pickup man. Also want to say thanks to Jerry Gudgel, a great Gudgel out there. He's a helping out. We appreciate you. So 80 points, 80 points for Bronk Horn. That's going to put him in the lead as of tonight and put him in third place overall going into the final few. All right, let's go to the Rose Ranch. Talon Miller is the name of the horse. Mood Swing, or I'm sorry, is the name of the rider. Mood Swings is the name of the horse. So Mood Swings is what we have right here. And he is trying to best the cowboy by the name of Talon Miser. We're going right down the pen, and the bay horse not giving Talon Miller what he needed. The Rose Ranch is Talon Miller. Talon Miller seems to be able to get it all done. Let's see what they think for the score right here. So the scores will be coming in momentarily. 78, 78 points for the team right there. So the Rose Ranch and Talon Miller. Miller, I can't say that, 78, 78. All right, moving back over here to the one, two, and three shoots. Looks like we're going to shoot number two is where we're going. And Diamond H plus C Cattle Company, they are up. So Dylan White is going to be the one that rides for them. Diamond H Ranch plus C Cattle Company, they are up with a horse they call Mexican Blackbird. We'll find out what Mexican Blackbird can do. Coming out of shoot number two right here. Greg Gutchell. Rooster Schwartz and Paul Solberg doing a good job out there for three lazy ass bronx, picking these cowboys up and setting them on the ground, keeping everybody safe. 
Going to have to be 82 and a half to move to the top spot. A little trouble right here is the horse leaning on him. They're trying to get that horse to stand up straight and be on all four feet. The horse stands to be standing backwards on a hip, trying to push on that cowboy's leg, and it's pretty hard to get your legs down in those stirrups. It's tough enough when everything's right. It's awful hard when one is leaning on you like that. If he's leaning on you, he's going to come out wrong, throw you out of balance. Stuff could go upside down pretty quick. So right here, we're going to roll him up to shoot number three. And while I have the chance, I want to say thank you to the lovely and talented Tori Smith for being here because without her, certainly we wouldn't be able to uh, move forward. In fact, the world may stop if Tori wasn't here. So thanks, Tori, for all your help. And yes, she has a knife in my ribs. All right, we're going to go to shoot number three. <laughs> Just kidding, Tori. All right, let's see what we got. Let's get one road. So the Diamond H crew, plus C Cattle Company, Dylan White, Mexican Blackbird, fixing to take flight. Eight seconds right here, they can make a little noise for him. Well, he was getting it done right there, and then he got to the back end, decided maybe he better slow down, look for the man to get him on the ground, and here we go. He's right down here in front of you on these. Let him hear you now. Good job, Cowboy. Dylan White makes it look easy on a tough horse. 78, 78 points for the Cowboy. Good job right there. A couple left to go in the first section. Looks like we're going to go up here to shoot number one, Barta Cattle Company. Corey Bullington is the name of the cowboy. Bar the Cow Company. Corey Bullington on a horse they call Creeper. Hmm, Creeper. That's a, that's a name, all right, I guess. Corey Bullington's gonna be the man that comes out on him right here. Rolled him up to shoot number two, looks like. He's about ready to call for him right here. You bet, look at this. Took a little time to get it right. Hey, hey, looky here. Nice job across the pen. Big Bay, strong horse. All right, good work right here. Let's find out who it was, what they scored. And gonna be an 81, 81 for Corey Bullington and Creeper. That's gonna put him in a tie for second, third right now. Good work, young man. That should be one left to go, is that right? Flying in Cattle Company, Garrett Fry is the final man to go. Yes, sir! Get with him! Oh, Paint giving it to him! Round the circle he goes! Here comes our pickup man! Yes, sir! Boys and girls! That's the way it's done. He can hear you when he gets on the ground. Let him know what you think. Good job! All right, that's going to do it right there for the first section. That score coming in, and it's a 76. So not going to move the leaderboard. We did have an 81. That was enough to put him in time for second and third. So good job by all involved. Let's move down to the next event.